The pictures are horrifying. A blind man seen here on police surveillance video being savagely beaten on a Philadelphia street. Police have now released pictures of a suspect, Mustafa Guyton. Officers say Guyton lives near the intersection where that beating took place. They say the 33-year-old victim was walking down the block when the suspect approaches him. Though the camera panned away, you can see in the next shot the suspect kicking the victim and stomping on him, injuring his face and head. Police say after the brutal attack, the suspect picked up a backpack and walked away. Police did not indicate any possible motive for the attack. Even more shocking is that it appears that three people walked by, witnessed it, and seemingly did nothing. It's, you know, uh, despicable, really. And then the guy that does it just walks away like, like nothing happened. It's kind of ridiculous. Residents of the neighborhood were just as disgusted that this happened. It's just really bad, especially uh, uh, people that, that uh, uh, can't defend themselves. I mean, the guy's blind. This is not the first case of bystander apathy. In Queens, a good Samaritan homeless man was fatally stabbed coming to a woman's aid and was ignored by pedestrians walking by. And in this surveillance video, a Philadelphia transit officer struggled with a fare evader as multiple witnesses watched without calling police. People just might not want to get engaged because they think that the perpetrator may be carrying a gun. Being a good Samaritan these days is riskier than it used to be. So when you see something like that, you want to jump in, but is it the right thing to do for your own safety? So the police are hoping that the release of the surveillance video and the photo of the suspect will help locate that suspect. The police have also said that the victim told them that he did not recognize his attacker's voice. So they are searching for any information about the crime, about the suspect. Um, they're really pleading for so information.